Legionnaire's disease bacteria found at New York police station. Cops in East Harlem are going to have to forego showers at the station for a while after traces of a deadly bacteria was discovered at the police station. Legionella pneumophila is the bacteria that causes Legionnaire's disease. The disease usually occurs in large buildings as the water systems allow the bacteria to spread more easily. Inhaling just a small amount of water containing the bacteria can cause the disease to develop in the human body. Symptoms include headache, fever, chest pain, nausea, and diarrhea. People who are over 50 years old, smokers, and those with chronic lung disease are more susceptible to the disease. The New York City Health Department says between 200 to 400 cases of Legionnaire's disease are reported in the city each year. Two hotel guests who stayed at the Rio All Suite Hotel and Casino in Las Vegas separately in March and April also contracted Legionnaire's disease. The bacteria was found in one of the hotel tower's hot water systems. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Keep watching to learn more about potentially life-threatening diseases. Spread of Legionnaire's disease in New York tied to contaminated cooling towers. New York City officials declared that they will be more vigilant about locating cooling towers throughout the city and making sure they are properly cleaned. This comes after an outbreak of Legionnaire's disease that has been traced to contaminated cooling towers. An outbreak of Legionnaire's disease that has made more than 80 people sick in New York since early July has been traced to at least five cooling towers in the South Bronx. The towers have tested positive for Legionella bacteria, which can sicken people who inhale water droplets released from contaminated towers. The incubation period for Legionnaire's disease is 10 days. Symptoms include fever, cough, chills, and muscle aches. All of those who died from the disease so far were all older adults with underlying medical conditions. All five towers that were found to be contaminated with the bacteria have been cleaned, and officials say they expect the rate of infection for the disease to taper off soon. Mysterious Elizabeth Kingia bacteria claims 20 lives. A mysterious bacteria known as Elizabeth Kingia has killed 20 people in the Midwest in the United States. The Elizabeth Kingia bacteria can be found in soil, river, and reservoirs worldwide. It can cause meningitis in newborn babies and meningitis or bloodstream and respiratory infections in people, typically older, with compromised immune systems. Symptoms of the Elizabeth Kingia infection may include fever, chills, headache and neck pain, as well as skin infections. There have been 61 confirmed cases in total in Wisconsin, Michigan and Illinois, in which 18 people were confirmed dead in Wisconsin, one in Michigan and one in Illinois. Doctors are actively investigating the origin of the infection and the cause of the multi-state outbreak. Tree Man No More it may have taken a year and an insane number of surgeries, but this Bangladeshi man couldn't be happier to finally have his hands and feet back. A rare disease caused lesions to appear on the man's skin at the age of 10. They worsened over time and made it difficult for him to make a living as a rickshaw driver. Soon, bark-like growths started sprouting from his hands and feet, making it impossible to do anything except scratch his neck. The 27-year-old was dubbed Tree Man by the international media and is one of only four people in the world to ever be diagnosed with the disease. Doctors in Dhaka offered to treat him free of charge and moved him and his family to the hospital last February to begin the first of many surgeries. 16 operations later, doctors have removed 11 pounds of growth and restored Tree Man's hands. He'll still need a few more surgeries to pretty up his digits, but now he can at least eat, write, and hold his daughter. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Man develops fat deposits on neck from hard drinking. A man from China developed huge fat deposits around his neck after drinking nearly one liter of hard liquor every day for three decades. The man, named Hong Su, was diagnosed with a rare disease called Madalong disease, where fatty deposits accumulate in the neck. Hong Su has been suffering from the disease for over a decade, but only recently saw a doctor to have it diagnosed. Hong had become a recluse, staying indoors at home and financially relying on his family. It wasn't until recently that Hong went to doctors about his condition, because turning his head, swallowing, and even breathing had become more difficult as the fatty deposits continued to grow. 
It took three surgeries to remove all the deposits, the largest of which was more than six inches wide and around five and a half inches long. There have only been around 400 instances of the extremely rare disease around the world. The disease is most often brought on by heavy drinking, although a few non-alcoholics have been known to develop the condition as well. Hopefully, Hong Su will learn to moderate his drinking in the future, or he could just have the surgery again in another 30 years.